According to the World Health Organization, depression is now the leading cause of death and disability in modern to high-income nations like Canada. At the Centre for Addiction and Mental Health in Toronto, Dr. Jeffrey Meyer and his team use PET scanning to discover why this illness is so common. So what we can do with this technology is we can brain scan people to look at a protein that eats up serotonin in the brain. So in 2006, using this type of technology, we discovered that this protein that eats up the brain chemical serotonin uh, is uh, increased tremendously in the midst of depressive episodes, in the midst of a clinical depression. With that knowledge, Dr. Meyer and his team identified several conditions that put people at high risk of depression so they could develop strategies to prevent the illness from escalating. For example, the risk of getting a depressive episode in early postpartum is 13%. It is the most common complication of childbearing. So what we've done with this scanner is that we had a study in which women came in uh, day four to six postpartum and they came in for a scan and we discovered that again this same brain change that we saw in clinical depression occurs temporarily in early postpartum. So we have a dietary supplement that we're developing that will replace um, the chemicals that get taken away in early postpartum. 